Vinny, I needed a wayward soul. Hello, wayward soul. Uh, Brad, what is this? And I came calling. Knock, knock, knock. I thought, I thought you fit the bill. Uh, uh, this is wayward souls. Four. On the iPhone. Oh, don't kill me. Oh, this guy's a jerk. What's uh, going on here? This is uh, this is on iOS. It's uh, it's also on iPad, but we get that sweet sweet 16 by 9 if we play it on the iPhone. We also uh, get the uh, the frame rate. Yeah, uh, standard standard iOS disclaimer. We also get to jack up frame rate when we do the HDMI out. Which so is, what you see is not what you get on just the not, iPhone, right? Not necessarily. Yeah, this game is perfectly. Oh my god. Smooth. Jerk. Um. Come here, you. Get him. Trying. What do you gotta do? What's the trick? Just kind of maneuver behind him is the only thing I've found for these guys. Come here, you. Charge. I'm having some real trouble here. There we go. All right. So what? What is the? Uh, what is Wayward Souls? Uh, so I was looking at the uh, like little press kit for this, like the kind of description of the game. You know, the standard pitch. Mm -hmm. They describe it as Spelunky meets Secret of Mana, which I think is a perfect description. Okay. Of this game. Um. It's totally, you know, it's permadeath. It's, uh, you know, each run is unique as far as what you're going to find item-wise and that kind of thing. Uh, different character classes. It's made to be repeatable, you know. Sure. Very Splunky-esque in that you're going to play it over and over. Um, and the Secret of Mana stuff is just the, It's like... just, you know, the overhead. Like, you gotta, you gotta charge attacks and stuff mm -hmm. like that. You know, it plays very much like that. This room looks kind of ominous. Uh, multiple character classes. I'm, I'm sure I will die here forthwith. Yep, yep. Oh my, god. I, oh my god, I've never even seen these guys before. Oh. Uh, what, kind um, of, what kind of controls are you doing? It's totally touch controls, like... I'm not gonna, quite gonna call it virtual D-pad, because there's no actual D-pad on the screen or anything. But I do have my, uh, my left thumb is in the lower left corner. Uh, okay. And that's what I'm using to, to move around. And then you just tap the lower right corner to attack, and then... Tap and hold to do that. Okay. Uh, swipe up on this character class will throw an axe. Swipe down uses your shield. Oh, wow. Well, I haven't quite figured out how to use the shield, really. I guess you just hold it up until... Something hits? Until something hits you, yeah, because it seems yeah, like you're holding it. Because every time you tap, you... Uh... And then when you attack, it goes away. Oh, wow. I think that's how that's working. Uh, every character class is totally different, though. They all have different abilities and stuff. Um... And what's your objective here? Just explore? It's basically just get as far as you can. I mean, I'm in the second uh, kind of area. I made it through the first area and beat the first boss right before this. Do you get a shortcut um, for your next playthrough? Yeah, so you can uh, you can start on whatever the farthest area is that you've gotten to, but only on that character class. Like uh, the other characters, I have to start at the beginning of the game again. Have you found um, that the uh, <laughs> swiping up and down brings up your like shortcut? To yes, you've probably seen. Uh, let's see if I can make it happen here. Yeah, that thing yeah. popping up. Uh, yeah, that, that that tends to happen a little bit. Um, it's not my favorite way to play an action game by any means, but it's serviceable. I think I'm, I'm not, I'm not having a terrible time with it. Do you see? Do you think uh, the? Uh, oh boy, iOS device is a weird platform for this. Uh, I, I don't know. Have they made it work? Kinda. Um, what was that move? The, the thing I threw. Yeah. That was my axe. How'd you throw that? Uh, that's a swipe up. Whoa! Uh, but I have a limited number. I've only got what four of them left. Yeah. Up, you can see up there. Uh, I should use... What else do I have? Nothing! I don't have any other potions or anything on this run. What's in here? Um... Ouch. My, uh, oh no! I thought I was dead. I got I no life I thought you were left. dead too. Weird. They have like some amulet of oh, one more shit, chance. Shit, 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 shit. Uh... Hang on. Let me... Let me finish out this life before I try to say anything else. Intelligent. Or not. There you go! Yay! Hey, use those axes. Out. You're not gonna need them when you're dead. Oh, shit. Shit. Oh, yep. That was a case of... It happens once in a while. That was a case of, like, my thumb barely moved off the side of the screen and, oh. I, st and I stopped moving. Okay. Which, yeah, that, that stuff gets a little frustrating. This game is uh, this game is coming to PC at some point. Hmm. So you can definitely play it on a controller. And there you go. There's your there's, there's tombstone with your... Um, yeah, Amaranth Keep is uh, I'm the sorry? second area. Amaranth Keep? Amaranth Keep. Uh, I'll show you real quick. So now you're starting again? Yeah, so, well, yeah. Uh, I'll, I'll play a different character class. Uh, but yeah, the, the tower is the second area after I beat the mines with this dude. Um, what is that stuff I was going to But I already used uh, him. Upgrade paths? Yeah, I'll, I'll, I'll pop back in here. I, I, I just got this guy. So what do you, what do you keep from playing through the place? What does he do? Uh, money is, as far as I know, money is the only thing. You can see it up there. What does this guy do? 
Burning Lantern that repels magic. Probably not going to use that much. Stunning magical. Yeah, okay, fine. Balance sounds pretty, pretty yeah. neat. I get early health bonuses. That sounds nice. Uh, so that you get the money uh, on your previous runs. Yeah. And then you've got these upgrades here that I could buy, and I think these are randomized, or they might be specific to the class. Yeah, it says upgrade. I don't know if these are specific to the class you're playing. Or... Is this for the only the next playthrough? Yeah, it's just for this run. Okay. Uh, but they're pretty cheap, and you get tons of money. So is there anything that you'll get that is uh, permanent upgrades? I don't think so. I mean, you can, you'll upgrade your gear as you go on a run, but you lose all that stuff when you die. Okay. Uh, plus one max health. Uh, hmm. That doesn't sound so good. Hmm. Uh. Well, you can buy, like, almost all of these. I could, yeah. Uh, that sounds good. Yeah, sure. I'll get those. And then these down here, you have to, uh, you have to work your way up to. What's that $5,000 one? Uh, that's a good question. Huh. Is that big? Weird. Uh, yeah, I guess so. That's weird, I don't... I don't know if that's permanent or not. That's so expensive, you would think that... Well, you had a thousand gold. I don't know if well, it's that Well, that's true. I mean, that's, that's, a, that's after, like, six or seven runs, though. I mean, if it is the last thing. Um, well, what I mean is, though, I thought these were all single-use, like you lost them when you bought them. Yeah. But maybe not. Next level, maybe you do keep these. What are, uh, what are... Sorry, let me... Let's just try to figure that out real fast. Uh, if I were to try this guy... Oh, maybe they're per character? Okay, yeah. Looks like, uh... I bought this one before, I believe. Okay, you do keep these. It would make sense to make your survivability Yeah, yeah, yeah. I thought, I thought these were all single-use, like you lost them when you died, but... Uh, yeah. but they are per character. But yeah, yeah, they, yeah. Because they, I think they've all got different upgrades. Like, yeah. slightly specific? Like, she's got... Like, her upgrades are more about her kind of nimbleness as a thief. Mm -hmm. She's winking uh, a star. X. Blah, blah, blah. All right. What's her 5,000? Uh, I think that's the same for everybody. No, I guess it, less energy. Oh, wow, you're right. So hers is less energy. Jeez, you could really... You could really do some stuff if you got all those. What's this one? Less mana. Recover energy faster. But it's all classes, right? Yeah. So like if you so were if you get to... that, you could yeah, it applies right. to everybody. What was his? Huh. Wow. Yeah, that's um, interesting. Yeah. No yeah. microtransactions. It's kind of a in good incentive to no, what is it? Yeah, you can't you can't buy coins or anything, okay. which is kinda nice. Uh that's just okay. some stuff. Yeah. Standard stuff. Uh, that's a, that's an interesting incentive to play other classes yeah. when you get benefits that behoove you totally. to, you know. For course, all classes. Yeah, though. totally. Of course, you can make you can make all your money with your favorite class and then just go buy it. Uh, buy the upgrades for whoever. Um, I'm going to try this guy because I just unlocked him. He's the only class I have. There's two others. Oh, Jesus, boy. Man, she is really... Rawr. Rough looking. Fallen Kingdom. Hmm. Okay. Guessing there's three areas in the game so far? I'm look at the map screen. All right, let's play. Want to buy anything else? Yeah, Do it just, to it. Let's just go. So yeah, like all the other oh, classes, and then, yeah, you have to start okay. back at the beginning if you haven't uh, haven't gotten up there with them yet. Uh, there's a little bit of story for each class. Uh, oh, he's got a lot less reach. It looks like. What does he do? Got a little bit of sword. Uh, he's not that different from the other guy as far as his standard attack. He had some like burning lantern he can throw. Yeah. Oh boy. Oh, they're right out of the gate here. Do you think you would prefer this with a controller? Absolutely. Like, no question. Um, but it's only out on iOS right now. But you said it... Uh, but they, they do say PC. Android and PC are both coming. Uh, it's four ninety nine on iOS. It's got kind of an interesting pricing structure because uh, the price is going to go up a dollar every time they put out a major update. <laughs> what? So really, they've got like three. Are they content updates? They're yeah, talking about? yeah, like a new character, a new area, uh, other new features. They're actually they're going to put controller support into this. How do you do that? Which I I have it's no like idea. I still don't know how the iOS controller stuff is working. Like I know that, like Apple put out like an API for it a while back or something. Mm -hmm. I'm not really sure. Also, like who wants to like balance their phone on their lap and play well, you can, the controller? Well, I should assume you use AirPlay or Apple TV or something. Yeah, that, that might one. work. Or even with an iPad, you could stand the iPad up and it wouldn't be that bad. What's uh? Is what this, could it mean? Is this unique for each class? Yeah, the, yeah. There's actual story. Like I haven't really paid much attention to it, but yeah, each class uh, has its own story. I mean, they're named characters, you know, like the the 
the main warrior guy, like his brother was killed, and he's, oh. you know, looking for vengeance or whatever. Uh, are you getting XP? I just like playing with this. Uh, no. As far as I know, yeah, there's no, there's no, like, actual character okay, upgrades. Okay, so it's the money, well, the character upgrades are back on that other screen we saw, right? Yeah, so you money yeah you're not leveling up, I guess I should say. Uh, and you, did you lose all your money by continuing? I don't know what happened there. Are you talking about this yellow thing down yeah. there? Yeah. I'm really not clear what what's up with that. Well, let's see if you go through, because you had uh, about, do you remember how much you had by the end? No hats. I, I had 900 Okay. when I came in here. Maybe, um, maybe you got a pool of money. Oh, boy. Uh, but you find, you do find loot? Ouch. Uh, yes. Well, it's actually, uh, I haven't found it. Oh, man, I forgot those guys blow up. I haven't found a lot of what I would call loot, exactly. Like, these slots over here? Are yeah. Not, I see a sword like, and I some can't, kind of... I can't tap on them to see what they are. Oh. Like, I am tapping them and nothing happens. Hmm. Also, I don't know what's up with hats. I haven't found a hat <laughs> yeah. yet, either. Um... Not yet. The, the main upgrade stuff I found is there's a forge that you'll run in, run into. Oh, it's like plus one your sword or something? Speak of the devil. Here's the forge. Uh, and it always randomly picks a piece of equipment for you to upgrade. So in this case, I guess it's my necklace. Or what is that costing you? Nothing, it's free. But you, well, can, only, you can only get one or the other. Phasing dash that stuns foes. Hmm, short range explosive attack. That's with a stun. That seems pretty short term. Okay. Stun also with a stun. Huh. It sounds so similar. Yeah, maybe I'll try that one. I think this is for my amulet. Yeah. I think of the the expendable thing. See what happens. Is that it? Oh, I'm wasting them now. I don't know. Uh. <laughs> mushrooms. Stuff. Uh, how often do you get stuff? Like that forge? Uh, or any drops or anything? Um, not very. Are they in chests? Oh, I hate these guys. Like, what do you what do you get for killing an enemy? Well, like, kind of nothing. I mean, money. Sometimes they'll drop money. Like these big guys, I think, often drop money. Let's try that. Did that? Is that a stun? I don't know. That did. I'm not sure what that's doing exactly. Oh shit! Was that it? That's your lantern. Yeah. This guy's this class is kind of weird. Hey, yeah, you get some coin. Yeah. Yeah, like I said, money comes very quickly. Uh, I don't think you would have that hard a time getting one of those 5,000 coin upgrades if you... Like, really? It's, yeah, if you really want to put your mind to it. There's a chest up there, or are those just crates? Uh, yeah. these are just crates. Chests are always, like, glowing, so you can definitely tell. Blue fire! Yeah. Magic happening. Think so? Oh, yeah. I... Oh! <sighs> what? Did it drop something? No. A lot of stuff that falls and looks uh, like you should be able to pick it up. It's blue and glowy! I know, man. That's what they know. The language of video games. Hello. Nice. Unyielding protection. Oh, it's dead end. Yep. You got a star. Go! It's probably gonna run out by the time I find another enemy. Yeah, this is weird. Like, this is... It's like the perfect mass transit game. Because the runs are short. You know, it's very pick-up-and-play. Except that... Being in any kind of moving vehicle and trying to play with this control scheme... Yeah, yeah, not so fun. Not really... Getting your elbow bumped or something. Yeah. Not a good standing-up game, either. No, definitely not. Uh, of course, on the PC, you're going to lose the portability, so. Is that another dead end? I'm going here. Alright. Oops. Looks pretty nice. I think yeah. the music is decent. Like it's, uh, it's. Oh, there's a glowy. Yeah, what do we got? Cash money. What is that thing? What is that thing? Oh, okay. Gave up my seat today for a guy who, uh, had a cane. Uh -huh. I'm pretty sure it was a cosmetic cane. Oh, no. Was but he an older gentleman? It was, like, probably, like... Yeah, he was a little older. Looked like he needed a cane? No. No. <laughs> but, uh, yeah, he got a cane. I'd rather play it safe than sorry. Yeah, you can't really question a guy, right? Yeah. Yeah, he took the seat, so... I hate it, oh, oh. man. 
I've got a short list of things that really bother me in life. Uh -huh. It's not huge. I mean, it's not super short, but it's not huge. Yeah. But people not getting out of the priority seating for pregnant women and ah, elderly. And the elderly. Uh, is pretty high on that sure. list. What's like, especially like young kids. How do you define priority? Like the the ones that are more accessible, like the ones up front. The ones that say priority seating. Oh, is that a, is that a Bart thing? Yeah. Are they I think, I think the they're media? on the mini as well. They, they probably are. I'm, I'm always in the very back of the bus yeah. where there is no priority seating. I don't know why. I'm just, uh, I, for some reason, I always sit as far back in the bus as I can. I mean, even if you're not in the priority seating, like, you know, do the world a favor and get up. Sure. But, like, you, you take it on yourself by sitting in those seats. Oh, that, yeah. You're talking about the ones where, like, they're for handicapped it's easier and, like, to sit in yeah. and stuff, right? The ones near the front. By, by yeah. the door. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I've never, I don't think I've ever really seen that before. Have you, have you actually, like, it seems so egregious, I'm just like, who would even do that? Oh, yeah, I've seen it all the time. Like? During commuting hours? Like, elderly person gets on and, like, nobody like, like gets up? Yeah, like, kids with headphones make eye contact. Oh, God. And just, like, put the head back down. Damn kids have no respect. No respect. There's not always kids, but... But it's usually kids. Sometimes it's kids. The thing I'm getting really annoyed with on public transit is people using their phones as, like... Some like kind of phone? yes, like some kind of glorified like boombox, yeah, or whatever. Yeah. Uh, I actually saw. Uh, I can't remember exactly how it went. There was a kid doing that like really loud, and he got into a scuffle with another passenger over it. Like, hey, can you turn your phone down? Yeah, and like he was not having it. Then the he bus... said, he said no. Nope. Well, yeah, he was like yelling about it. And then the bus driver got involved, and he was like, I will put this bus into service mode and make everybody get off if you don't turn that shit off. Oh, was it pretty loud? It was. It was really loud. So you have to imagine, right? Like, if somebody's doing that and they are blasting that out of their phone, they're they're at they're looking for that fight. Probably. They're yeah. looking to he get. Was, in, they was, want yes. that fight. I think he was. Like, I think he relished the altercation. Right. It was shitty. Not how you want to start your day when you're just trying to get to work. Like I think there's some people who play a game and don't realize how annoying it is. Yeah. And keep it on, keep it on speaker. But like somebody who's just blasting music is looking for that attention. Yeah, sure. Whoa. Wow. I will have to remember that. I just sit down next to them and start singing with them in their, <laughs> in their ear. I love this fucking song, man. Put your arm around their shoulder, <laughs> just like, yep. <laughs> so Whoa. great. Whoa. I'm so glad you're playing this for everybody right now. Uh, Alright, what does this do? Oh, wait, is that... Hmm. Oh, this is quickly going bad. Am I still in the mines? I am, right? Because this looks like, completely different than the last yeah. time I finished the mines. Uh, like, the uh, tile set, like the enemies, I haven't seen any of this stuff before, so... This is all new code. Yeah, so, I, yep, totally. We've got some crazy items now, uh, too. Yeah, what else? What do I got going on up here? That's, uh... Okay, yeah, I've used those before. Those are good. Okay. And how do you how do you access those? Uh, you just whoa, it's like swipe you just go left. Here and swipe, oh, okay. No, you double tap. Oh. So you have to go into the menu to do it. First thing about this game is just there's like almost no healing. <laughs> I guess there are health potions. I don't think I've ever seen one though. Hmm. Uh, and you get a little bit of health at the end of every floor. I saw that was, as one of the uh, upgrades. Uh, yeah, you, you get yeah, more I health. Think one of the upgrades was to get more health. I'm actually feeling okay about this run, other than my. Other than my low health bar. Oh, this looks bad. Use some items. Holy shit. Alright, let me try to get my position on. There we go. Is that the flash bomb? Yeah, okay. What did that do? I gotta capitalize. They oh, all got stopped. blinded. Ah! Is that burning an item when I do that? Ow! Oh no! Holy oh, shit! Oh no! Wow. My adventurer. Man, that was rough. Later, Cyril. So you had 900 coming in. Yep. So let's see. Let's see where I'm at. Let's see if you've got over a thousand now. Mm. Yeah. Okay. So you do keep uh, yeah. your general. Pool. Yeah. Those are yeah. That's that's cross heroes. <clears throat> uh, you want to see one more character real fast? Do you buy those other two? No, no. You unlock them. I get this guy if I beat the second uh, oh, yeah. area of the tower. Yeah, let's see another. Uh, let's see like a magic user I or. Rogue. I assume Fallen Kingdom is the third. Uh, I've never used the mage. I guess let's try her. Rogue, Rogue, is, Rogue has dodges and a backstab. You know, she's pretty standard stuff. Uh, go air. Dump some money into... Torrent of Burning Flames. Yeah, okay. Let's see. What do we got here? Ooh. Mm. A robe charge. 
That sounds all right. Sure, I'll get that. Chance of conserving, uh, that's probably also good. Who's your main? You like the warrior? Yeah, I've been playing him the so most. you probably gonna dump the most money into him? Yeah. Yeah, let's conserve. Yeah, it looks like there's room for three. Maybe four here, I don't know. Yeah, they've got their updates uh, planned out pretty specifically. It's like, update two is the one with new area, update three has new character. So you think by the time it comes to PC, it'll just be full price I, all the I, updates? I bet, it'll, yeah, it'll have all the stuff in it. Uh, but if you're into this and you want to get it on the phone, I might wait for the PC. Yeah, I probably would too. I don't know. This, I, this is definitely playable. I'm feeling okay about it, but... I get bummed when I stand on the, the bar yeah, for the train. Yeah, you absolutely need to be sitting <laughs> and, like, and yeah. like motionless to play this properly. Ow. If I can get one arm hooked around one of the poles or something, then I'm maybe okay. Yeah. Uh, that's pretty dicey. I definitely wouldn't play a game like this. Rather play like spellbounders or something. I don't know, that ranged attack seems alright. Yeah, I you know, I feel like I may take back what I was saying about the mage. I mean maybe Except not. I can't seem to hit that thing. Maybe not super strong. Well they don't like give that. you anything, right? Uh no they don't. What do I have up here? Hmm. Okay. Let's try out some of my spells. Let's try it. Oh god. Wait. Oh, okay. That's pretty good. Yeah, the range on that is not so hot, though. Yeah. Oh, they hit each other? What is that? I think so. Oh, that was so close. Oops. I'm not yeah. sure what that does, but I got an achievement for it. Whatever it was. It looked like some kind of knock... Uh... I, maybe a knockback or something? Uh, it looked like you have blown back somebody's projectile. Yeah, maybe point. that's what it was. But uh, I'm sh I think it said when you picked the character, we just didn't yeah, pay attention. Was, yep. What? What? We didn't put what? What? What are you talking about? I know. I know, it's crazy. Get that money! It doesn't even tell you how many coins it is when you pick it up. No. Oh. You know, you could, you could be fairly precise with this thing. For the most part, rather than like occasional thumb slip or something where it, it's, it can be a little frustrating, mm. like it's, it's playable. Did uh, all the characters have like an energy bar? Yeah. That's what uh, most of them just use like their charge attack for that, which I wasn't using very much. What's her charge attack? That's a good question. Whoa. Wow. It's nice you can it's run around focused. while you're charging that, so. It's a lot of energy though. Secret best class. Maybe. She doesn't have a lot of health, though. You are a wizard. I'm a what? A wizard. I'm a what? A wizard, Annie. Is that her name? Annie? Yep. Alice? Sure. Go with Annie. Uh. Uh? That's kind of what I know about Wayward Souls. Well, let's, let's see how far you go on this run. Wait. I missed something. That's really weird. Like they just put the exit right by the entrance. I could skip this whole floor if I wanted. Oh no, I don't want to do that. You don't want to do that? You want to get in that know. forge. Yeah, they seem to do a pretty good job of mixing up the, the random levels. Abbey. Abbey, okay. Uh, an earthen orb. Fear of ice. Pearls of Sphere of Ice. I kind of like the sound of that. Slowing Hail. Anything that slows or stuns I always find is pretty great. So, so when you made it to the next level, did you, uh... Wait, so how do you use that thing? It just replaces whatever thing Amulet in you question. Have so health? instead of the, I believe it would be... Yeah, that's it. Yeah. Instead of the, the little flamethrower thing, I have that now. Vigorous Haste. Go, 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 oh, go, so go, 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 go. Um, when you made it to the next level, did you find another forge? Um, I didn't make it past the first level of the next area, so... Oh. I, 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 ouch. I would assume there probably is more, yeah. Uh, had to fight a fairly tough boss to get there, too. Well, I like the, uh, you know, I like the fact that you have some persistent progression. Yeah, sure. 
you know, yeah, it's it's totally Splunky-ish or, you know, well, Splunky. ro roguelike-esque, if you like. Well, yeah, but, uh, like, not with the persistent progression. Well, I was going to say in that you lose most of your upgrade and stuff, but, yeah, you do keep those. Well, you, you lose your, your gear, I should say, but you keep those upgrades that you buy. It looks as long like. as, like, you don't feel like you're wasting an entire right. turn, right? Right. Even when you die, you're, like, working or you're building. Building towards something. More like Rogue Legacy. Sure, yes, yes. That's a good comparison. I need full. I don't think so. Should use some when you're yep. full. Ah! That guy did not give a poop. I give it a toss. Oh, that goes through enemies. Ah! Well, for that kind of energy, I hope so. I'm out. Boy. I'm still out. Stunt. There we go. Yeah, you know, this mage is not bad. Yeah. Take back everything I said. Oh. It doesn't seem like, yeah, there's... Oh, with the chest. Money's. Ash. Hmm. <laughs> getting your hopes up. Yeah, it looked like. Oh, boy. Oh, that's got a range on it. Blanks. I mean, the door opened. Oh, I bet that's what that was. Aha! That's how you do it. Oh, jeez. Oh! Did you put headphones on when you're playing on the bus? Yeah, usually for something like this where, you know, the music is worth listening to and stuff, yeah. Oh, fudge. Soundtrack nice. available on Bandcamp, if you like. Oh, yeah? How many floors uh, per level? Five. So, I don't know, what are we on here? What is that? Friendly Sprite! That totally looks like a Secret of Mana Sprite. <laughs> Play that game? Uh, yeah. yeah. Great. It's a great game. And then Secret of Evermore? Uh, yeah, that was made by the U.S. Squaresoft. Kind of, I think it was meant to appeal to the same audience, but it was not the same people by any means. I never it, played that. It wasn't a direct sequel? No, definitely not. There was a Seiken Densetsu 3, which was the sequel to Secret Mana in Japan, which but, looked awesome. Like, at, at the time, mm -hmm. like, if you were into that Square Enix kind of RPG on the Super NES, like, that game looked effing incredible, and then it never came out here. Uh, Mana had the... You can play two people, right? You can, yeah, you can play three. Control. You can play all three at once, Could I believe. You? You, you just had the, the multi-tap yeah, thing? Yeah, if you had the adapter thing. Uh, yeah, that's kind of a cool game. Oh, right. This was the one. Oops. This is the one where the exit was right by the uh, yeah the entrance, right? Um, I know there's been, like, fan translations of the, the third. Well, let's see. Secret of Mana was taken to Setsu 2 in Japan. So three was the, the follow-up. What would have been Secret of Mana 2. Oh, and the first one never came out here? Yeah, the first one was, I think, like a Game Boy game or something. I get the story um, confused with Chrono Trigger, which uh, I know yeah. is probably pretty silly, considering how specific... Oh, what? You just crit that door? Ah. Uh, how specific the story is, but I think it's just the art style, yeah, my definitely. memories of what was happening on screen. Or... Super similar, yeah. Um. Oh. Ah, oh. Uh-oh. Don't look at Grandpa's nudie mags. Uh, yeah, I learned a lot about life. Do you get one of these each floor? Um, I don't think it's every single floor. It's pretty Mage frequent, though. folk. Mage folk. Muggles. Mudbloods. Mud. Was that the non-magical people? Uh, I believe that's the term for like half, half, and part, half. part wizards. Yeah. Wizards who procreated with non-wizards. So they lock the doors, so you can't just like run past. Uh, encounter areas? Yeah, there's a lot of kind of Zelda style, like, kill all the enemies before we open oh, the door. Okay. I was gonna ask if you just do a run no. for the exit. No, I wish I could. Oh my god. You're doing oh. alright with this uh, young lady, oh. though. Famous last words? Whoa. Just burn all your items. Oh shit, I forgot I just gotta let him do that. Um, oh yeah. That works. Um, 
I might have to dig up Seiken and Setsu 3 at some point. Yeah? Yeah, I know there's fan translations out there. I don't know that they ever re-released it with an official translation, but I'm sure that, I mean, the game's like almost 20 years old at this point. I'm sure the... I'm sure the Why fan, wouldn't you go for the first one? I'm sure the... Ah, it's a Game Boy game. I don't really care about that. I mean, I don't think they're connected in any way. Mm -hmm. um, it's just a style of game. But that third one looked really good. I've always been curious about it. Maybe I will play that on the internet at some point. In some fashion. Oh! Shit. Hello. Hi. Wow. Wow, that's a lot of cash. Tons of money. I think we're almost done here. I don't think this is going to last much longer. You mean you? Yeah. I just want, I was hoping to see the next, uh, I hope we didn't make it to the next part. It looks like glowy bit. Money. Hmm. This looks a little ominous. Oh boy. Combo! Yeah. Killing oh it. no! Oh boy. Uh, I'm curious if uh, if it's the same boss at the end of this. Oh Holy no! Shit balls. Ambush! Oh my god. What floor is this? Do you remember? Is this three? Mm, I'm not sure actually. He definitely heating up. Yeah, it's getting a little rough. Oh jeez. Oh man. This is really not cool. You got your uh, other swipe move. Ah, too. I'm dead. Oh, that's it. That's it. Good run though, Abby uh, the Mage. Thank you. I trained for it. A third floor. Yeah, I was not gonna make it. Not a chance. The share would take you to Twitter or Facebook. Or oh, something. I bet it would. I'm not <laughs> gonna find out. I bet it would. I'm not gonna find out. Uh, how much is it again? Four ninety nine, 4 .99 at, at present on yeah. iOS devices. Yeah, like I said, uh, every time they put out an update, it's gonna go up a dollar. So if you think you're into this, you should get it now while it's cheaper. And uh, do you get is this the one by play on iOS devices? Yeah, yeah, yeah it works on both. Cool. Um, I forgot to mention it's the uh, it's Punch Quest and, and Mage Gauntlet. It's it's the that those people. Hmm. If you played those games, what are those amulets that you could have slotted in there? Uh, I think that's just showing what your progress is. Oh, like you made the like first I, world. I got I got that uh, that one filled in right there because I finished. Uh, see, I finished the mines and I can go straight to the tower. Oh, more. got it. Okay. Uh, although judging by that, it makes it look like there are six areas, but maybe maybe that's counting the ones they haven't patched in yet. Hmm. Uh, but uh, yeah, that seems like a pretty good deal for five bucks. Or, you know, kind of keep an eye out on PC and see when that happens. Yeah, I think I'll probably wait for yeah, PC. Yeah, like if you're not dying to have an iOS action game, I would say maybe watch for that, but... Uh, Very cool. Thanks, yeah, Brad. thank you. Whoa.